are you what kind of projects are you working specifically working on right now that our audience uh, would like to know about yeah so um right now what we're trying to do is as i said we're just trying to we're trying to think of ways to monetize the things that we love doing um so one way a step towards that would be to start um doing things for tv or for this for cinema that are projects that we love doing so um right and now what we've been working on is a lot of development um a lot of development so we've kind of taken a step away from production putting stuff online um to kind of just sit back and just develop stuff so where do your develop ideas come stuff. from for um when you're in development where do your ideas come from i get a lot of my ideas from from okay so it's it's, it's cliche but real life that's it's real life situations but um also music i'm heavily influenced by music um and that influences a lot of ideas um uh and yeah the music real life um other films and mm i don't know i don't i don't i don't, I don't yeah just everywhere Would you really. have any um things in development that you can tell us about that ideas that you're pitching right now um oh Oh, it's a bit it's a bit hard because um one of the projects yeah one of the projects that I'm doing hasn't been done before at all like in the world so I can't talk about that project but um <laughs> we'll have to talk to you again when you get that up and running now yeah so that that project is basically um a solution to the problem I was talking about in regards to how to get people to pay for um content so I'm just thinking of a new way to kind of um we've kind of developed a new way for people to buy into um content online video content um by packaging it in a different way um so that's one of the main things and that that um includes a collection of films um so that's what we've been that's one of the things we've been working on 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 the stuff that we love doing and then in regards to um the film production stuff um that we've got quite a few different things so we've got probably about three films in there and a couple of um tv series one of them I can I can talk about which is called just a couple um and that's something that we've done a web series on um which is it's online to view and it's um about a relationship um two people that are in a really deep relationship they've been together for years and just how they deal with conflict um so that um it's a comedy um and it features my sister and um an actor called my sister Frida Till and an actor called Michael Salami and they um yeah so that's that's one thing we we've kind of we're now developing for TV so um, how what are you in the actual whole process are you are you a scriptwriter are you on the set every day can you go through that process a little bit oh okay cool um so my my role kind of jumps um depending on the project so that's why i kind of title myself as a filmmaker because a filmmaker includes writing producing and directing so uh, my main my main um title would be director um and i'm getting more into writing and the reason why i'm getting more into writing is because um i have a very strong vision all the time and it's hard to find um certain concepts or people that are aligned with that so i have to write what i want to see so i so that's one thing that so i've been kind of pushed to to start writing um so um so on with that particular project just a couple i write I, that was that was that's one project that i've been uh that i've that i've written um and i also direct on that project as well oh, um yeah. so in regards to the process um yeah it's pretty much just writing from real life experiences and just heightening them um and um or just or finding funny memes like you're familiar with memes online yeah. on instagram <laughs> yeah so just finding those about relationships and changing them and developing them and just doing things around that So where do you see your business and your life in 5 10 years? 20 years. Okay. 
the big question. Yeah, that's yeah. The um, question. Well, I would like, I would like, I would like um, to be um, to be doing feature films. Um, so that's that's one of the that's one of the big aims for Upshot to be able to produce feature films and also for me to be directing feature films. And then it's also to kind of um, make Upshot a bigger platform for young people coming up. So my, what I've tried to do is. I've laid the foundation of Upshot, which is kind of really helping my career as a filmmaker. And it's and through Upshot, I've been able to do some amazing things. Like, um, and what I want to do is position it in a way that once I'm once I'm there, like you know, the next batch of talent can come through in the same in the same way. Yeah. And it, and it's not even a thing where I have to wait till once I'm there because I'm still doing it now. I'm still I still kind of bring people on board and we and we develop. But I know that obviously once I once um, my my um, personal career also high, um, gets there and oh Sebastian Till's doing a feature film, it definitely will just help the brand and through the brand I'll be able to bring people through. So I guess it's kind of having that that trail. That's really exciting. That's really great. Well, thanks for taking the time to talk to us today at my come up. You had so many great answers and I think that this will be really helpful for young people in the film industry or in any industry trying to mm. make their trying to make their own way in the world. So mm. thank you very much. Definitely. Thank you for having me. Okay, great. Nice. Bye. Bye.